a good day ulit sa ating uh, mathematics class. This is for module 3 and we will be learning today about how to change mixed number or mixed fraction into improper fraction. Okay? So, sana makinig kayo at kung bago pa kayo sa aking YouTube channel, mangyari lamang subscribe. Are you ready? Let's begin! Alright, so we have here an example how to change mixed fraction into improper fraction. The rule is simple. You are going to multiply the denominator to the whole number and the answer of it will be added to the new numerator. And that becomes your new numerator. Okay? So we have, let's begin, 5 times 2 equals 10 plus 3. That is your answer. 13. So your new numerator is 13 over 5. Okay? So remember that improper fraction, the numerator is bigger than the denominator. Okay? Tandaan lagi. Ang numerator sa improper fraction ay laging malaki kaysa denominator. Okay? So, we have another example. 1 and 2 thirds. You are going to change into improper fraction again by multiplying and then plus. 3 times 1, 3. Plus 2, 5. So, your answer is 5. Copy the denominator. Okay? 5 thirds. Okay? Next. You have 2 times 4, 8, plus 1, you have 9, okay? 9, copy the denominator, 2, so you have 9 halves. We have here 6 and 1 fifth, 5 times 6, 30, plus 1, 31. Copy the denominator, 5, so 31 fifths, okay? Next, you have 3 and 4 sixths. Changing it into improper fraction again, 6 times 3, 18, plus 4, what is the answer? 22, okay? Copy the denominator, 6, so you have 22 over 6, okay? Last example, you have 2 and 1 fourth, okay? 4 times 2, 8, plus 1, 9, so your answer is 9 fourths, okay? Just like that, as simple as that, as easy as that. Always remember that in changing mixed fraction to improper fraction, you have to multiply the denominator with the whole number and then the answer will be added to the new numerator. And your new numerator is bigger than your denominator. That is an improper fraction. So as you notice, you have there 2 and 3 fifths becomes 13 fifths. 1 and 2 thirds equals 5 thirds. 4 and 1 half equals 9 halves. 6 and 1 fifth equals 31 over 5. 3 and 4 sixths equals 22 sixths. And 2 and 1 fourth equals 9 fourths. So as you notice, all the numerator is bigger than the denominator. Okay? Were you able to follow? And that's all. Thank you and God bless.